What's up YouTube, it's Creative Vice Media Group here and I'm going to show you a pretty cool effect that you can do to your images which is you when you isolate a certain part of the image it can be a person, it can be in my example the car from the background and make the background um, black and white and the selected part of the image still in colour so to do this what you want to do is first open your image into Photoshop and unlock it by clicking this lock yeah, double clicking it and press OK now what you want to do is make a selection of the part of the photo you want isolated and still in colour so for me it's going to be the taxi so what you want to do is get, grab your pen tool ok, make sure your settings are like mine and just start making a selection Okay, make sure that opacity is on zero so you can see what exactly you're selecting. And mine is going to be really rushed. Selecting a car like this, unless you do selecting items on a daily basis a lot of times it should take you around up to 10 minutes to make a decent selection Okay, not much left to do. Just keep making a selection. Okay. Once you join the two points together by just clicking, get a little circle, join it, right click and press mark selection, feather radius three pixels, press OK. Now once it's selected, see the taxi has been selected, you can delete the shape we just made and press Ctrl C, Ctrl V, which copies and pastes the selection. 
see if you can move taxi out first. Okay, now click on layer zero, which is the original image, and go control U or image adjustment view and saturation. Make saturation minus one hundred. Press OK. And that's basically the general idea how to do it. You can add little to make it look better you can like duplicate the cutout taxi by dragging it here and then go. Press blend mode soft light. And it just gives that colour effect, that burn colour effect. Um that's pretty much it. Um it's a cool effect, easy to do, doesn't take too long. And that's it. Please comment, rate and subscribe.